There are quite a few different substances out there on planet Earth that might be beneficial to mankind in many different ways. When used in small amounts, some of these substances we're about to mention have positive or useful side effects. However, if you're exposed to a little bit too much, they can certainly be lethal. From pure rattlesnake venom to destructive metals, here are 13 most toxic substances on Earth. Number 13, Asbestos. This cheap, insulating material was commonly used in houses until the shocking toxic effects were finally discovered. If you're living in an old home right now, it's very possible you could be breathing in asbestos and not even know about it. The only problem is that it's extremely deadly and can cause lung cancer after exposure. There's actually a city in Quebec, Canada named Asbestos where you can go and visit the actual mine. Many people don't believe the serious effects of this toxin and continue to use it despite its poisonous qualities. This photo here shows two young children completely covered in blue asbestos, which is the most toxic kind at a playground in Australia. Unless you like rock minerals trapped in your lungs for decades, don't come near this stuff. This normally isn't poisonous right away and it takes at least a few years until it develops into mesothelioma. Number 12. Caffeine you might be a little bit surprised by this, but you can actually overdose on caffeine. While your body probably won't allow you to OD on Starbucks coffee, you can definitely OD on caffeine. It's quite similar to overdosing on other stimulants such as cocaine. Ingesting too much caffeine can result in trouble breathing, confusion, hallucinations, vomiting, increased heart rate, and even death. However, most fatalities are from taking doses of caffeine pills well above the recommended dosage and would equate to at least 50 cups of coffee. In another case, it took 7 to 8 cans of an unnamed energy drink which triggered a cardiac arrest. One monster, for example, contains 480 milligrams of caffeine well above the daily recommended dosage, which is only 400 by the way. So just be careful. Number 11, Sarin. Sarin is a man-made nerve agent developed by Germans in 1938. What was supposed to be a pesticide turned into an extremely deadly gas. This causes muscles to twitch uncontrollably, triggering horrific pain throughout the body and then eventually death by asphyxiation. Sarin has been used a number of times during wars such as the Iran-Iraq War in the 1980s. Terrorists were able to get their hands on this stuff with shocking results too. The perpetrators released this neurotoxin in several subway lines in Tokyo. 12 died from this chemical, but about a thousand were left with non-fatal injuries. Some have even accused Syria of using this deadly toxin recently in rebel provinces of the unstable country, which would be considered a war crime. Number 10, Polonium. Possibly one of the most dangerous substances on the periodic table of elements is polonium. Polonium is quite strange because it's nearly invisible to all radiation detectors and its radiation won't be able to penetrate a sheet of paper which makes it possible to transport fairly easily. However, polonium will cause significant damage if only a little bit is inhaled or ingested. All it takes is 50 nanograms or inhaling 10 nanograms before suffering from severe radiation poisoning. In 2006, doctors in Russia were shocked to find out that a former officer of the KGB was administered five times a lethal amount in his tea. This was the first case of polonium poisoning ever recorded. It was concluded that this type of polonium had to have been made by a state-regulated nuclear program. Number 9. Ricin Ricin is one of the most deadly poisons in the world and the side effects are just gruesome. Ricin is found in the castor oil plant and destroys your body's cell builders. The result from this substance, even if you survive, is severe damage to all your major organs. Just one milligram is enough to kill an adult if it's eaten or inhaled. This makes many countries curious about its possibilities as a chemical weapon. The gastrointestinal system is left destroyed and vomiting of blood is noticed first. Let's just hope this chemical doesn't get into the wrong hands. Number 8. Arsenic Arsenic has been used as a sneaky way to poison someone for centuries and certainly one of the most abundant toxic substances on earth. It's considered to be an acute toxin, which means it can cause severe injury or a fatality as a result of a short-term high-level exposure. Arsenic can also be found at high concentrations in different types of soil, especially in areas where mining has occurred. In the modernized world, there's a very low risk of being exposed to arsenic, but in third world countries, many water sources can contain arsenic, which is then found in the fish too. High levels of arsenic will ultimately lead to multi-system organ failure and your body will essentially be starved of energy. 
Number 7. Snake Venom What's kind of frightening about snake venom is that it's so toxic and it's naturally produced inside living organisms. Snakes like cobras or black mambas have some of the most potent venom in the world, and unlike much of this stuff we already mentioned, it only takes a few hours to take full effect. The snake venom is a mix of several hundred proteins and neurotoxins that attack the cardiovascular and nervous system. Different snakes have different venoms, which might cause different side effects, but statistics have shown that one out of four snake bites can be life-changing. The inland taipan is considered to be the most toxic land snake, and just one bite has enough venom to kill 100 people. Number 6. Tetrodotoxin Tetrodotoxin is another toxic substance created by organisms, but mostly found in fish or aquatic animals. This includes species such as pufferfish, porcupine fish, ocean sunfish, and triggerfish, to name a few. This is one of the most horrifying substances you definitely don't want to come into contact with. The first symptoms occur within 15 minutes of ingestion. First, your body will reject the chemicals by vomiting and diarrhea. Then it slows down communication with the nervous system, leading to your face, lips and tongue becoming completely numb. Motor paralysis will soon occur, which will lead to the inability to walk, and you'll be in a state of complete paralysis. Finally, if enough is ingested, lungs and the heart will shut down, leading to death. Voodoo practitioners have been able to find just the right amount of this substance to paralyze people and then turn them into zombies when they wake up. Most, however, won't get the luxury of waking up, unfortunately. But risk-taking sushi enthusiasts put their lives on the line by having this fish on their plate. Although it's considered to be a delicacy, a potent neurotoxin is released from the puffer fish's skin, liver, gonads, and intestines. Chefs in Japan require a special permit to prepare the puffer fish, but of course, accidents still happen. Number 5. Mercury Mercury is all around us. It's in our fluorescent light bulbs, our thermometers, and even swimming in our oceans. It's also one of the most common elements that can turn cities into toxic wastelands. Look at New Idria, California, for example. The discovery of mercury here was important for gold mining, and this happened during a time when gold mining was sweeping through Northern California. The mercury is used to extract gold from gold ore, and it results in a much purer gold. It became an important mining location up until the mine was closed in 1972, and people began to realize how toxic mercury truly was. The mercury got into the people's water supply here and caused the shutdown of an entire city. Many cases of mercury poisoning are results of long-term exposure. For example, mercury is found in fish, and if you eat fish two times a day for 20 years, it leads to things such as reduced cognitive function, organ failure, muscle weakness, and speech impairments. This photo here shows a person experimenting with mercury, which is actually a liquid metal at room temperature. The slightest change of temperature with mercury will cause it to expand or retract, making it useful in thermometers. However, these thermometers are really dangerous and are less used. Number 4. Mustard Gas also known as sulfur mustard, this is definitely not something you want to put on your hot dog. Mustard gas gets its nickname from the unique rotten, mustardy garlic onion smell it gives off and is classified as a blister agent. So not only does it smell bad, but it will seriously blister your eyes and lungs. Once it's irritated your entire body's respiratory system, it then acts as a poison, attacking your body's cells. Eyes will swell, tear up, and the voice will coarsen. It's almost like pepper spray on steroids. Severe blisters are left to immobilize the intended target. This was commonly used in World War I and also in the Middle East during the Iran-Iraq War, although chemical warfare has been banned by the UN. Number 3. Ethylene Glycol Also known as antifreeze, this cheap substance can be deadlier than other poisons, not necessarily because it's more toxic, but because it has a fairly sweet taste to it, and it won't be easily detected either. It can be toxic to pets who might find the lure of the taste being irresistible, and it's unfortunately a common form of accidental pet poisoning. It's important to check for antifreeze leaks coming from your car. All it takes is less than 3 ounces of this stuff, and it can be fatal to a medium-sized dog. It's rapidly absorbed into the gastrointestinal system, which might give victims a brief feeling of drunkenness. But it quickly turns into one of those nights where you pounded down 10 shots of vodka and are feeling extremely nauseous. It will quickly lead to a brain and liver failure, and eventually, much worse. Even if someone survives ingesting this toxic substance, it's very likely they will have kidney damage, brain damage, and possibly blindness. Number 2. Botrytotoxin Another lethal substance found in nature, this one comes straight from a poisonous frog. This lethal cocktail of deadly toxins are used in poison darts and can kill its target within a matter of seconds. The strange part about this toxin is that the frog doesn't produce this chemical itself. 
it comes from a part of their diet of poisonous beetles. The poison paralyzes the muscles, leaving the victims immobile but still alive, similar to tetrodotoxin. Eventually, the poison moves to the heart and triggers a heart attack. Basically, you can't go around eating random frogs or beetles or you might get exposed to this one. And number one, botulinum toxin. You probably have never heard of the scientific name, but I'm sure you've heard of Botox. That's right, the stuff that people are injecting into their face to look younger is in fact a neurotoxic poison. Like a lot of things on this list, too much of a good thing is a bad thing. Not trying to give anyone ideas here, but if somehow terrorists got a hold of this substance, just one gram of airborne Botox could kill an estimated 1 million people. While a very small amount is used in treating muscle stiffness, this neurotoxin has devastating capabilities. Links between muscles and nerves are completely cut off, leading to respiratory failure. If you can't breathe, you can't live, end of story. 